when I was at home. Once he started getting sick, I didn't go anywhere because even while you're gone, you're worried. I can be here with him and I feel more comfortable. This is something that I myself want to do. He's here because he got Parkinson's from Agent Orange. He served his country, now his country's taking care of him. At eight o'clock, when I kiss him goodnight and tell him that I'm going, he goes, do you have to go? Can't you stay here? You know, and I said, no, I can't. And I consider myself very lucky that that happened this way because if they didn't have an apartment available, I would be driving back and forth. And even my daughters, I mean, they feel comfortable that, you know, that we're taken care of. When you're with somebody for such a long time, you want to be with them. You want to be there. You don't want to miss anything. And I spend the whole day with them. I have breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And then at eight o'clock, I go back to the arms. And then the same thing. People that come to visit, they think that I'm a patient, even though I'm, you know, not. And I pass all, like, the garbage people and the waitresses and them with the uh, glasses. Yeah, it's like one big happy family. I'm very happy here. We're very comfortable with the situation at the pavilion. I mean, they're so caring. You know, everybody up on the fourth floor is just wonderful. And all the administrators, they'll come up and they'll pitch in and they'll, you know, where they're needed, they'll just do it. Tell everybody I picked the best place possible out of the list that they gave me because some of the places, uh, I mean, it's just, I look at it as the good Lord was watching over my shoulder and he said, this is the way, you know, it's going to be.